you from sin, and sin will keep you from prayer. Oh, bless his name. And what we need, we need to get spiritual drunk. We don't need to be power drunk. We don't need to be political drunk. But we need to be spiritual drunk. Y'all ain't talking to me. I heard the Bible said in Joel 2.28, he said, in the last days, he said, I pour out my spirit upon all flesh. He said, your sons and daughters shall prophesy, and young men shall see vision, and old men shall dream dream. And then I want you to know that after the writing of Melchi, when the prophets had quit prophesying, and dreamers had quit dreaming dreams, and preacher put a lock on the church doors, and flee to the field to make a living for themselves. When the lamp went out in the temple, and spider webs in the cracks of the walls, and dust is stacked upon the altar, and somebody went behind the holders of holiness, and tore down the altar of God. They say, we way down in the valley, but we can't hear nobody pray. But I saw Jesus, the Lamb of God, after 400 years it expired. I saw Jesus when he looked down from Shekinah glory and said, I'm going down. And he made another stop flight. And when he left heaven, the angels drooped their wings and they wrapped wheel tears. And they had a protest in heaven saying, don't leave us. But Jesus speeded past the sun, came beyond Junivers and Mars, and used the stars for his steps, and came all the way down and wrapped herself up into the womb of a woman. And the news got back to heaven. It was on a Christmas morning that a boy child was born. And I heard that angelic choir. And the choir began to sing. They holler glory to God in the highest. And peace on earth and goodwill toward me. Jesus, when he was born into the world, he changed the course of the world. And king became trouble on the throne. And big shot became trouble. And somebody looked at him at the age of 12 and said, little boy, say, how old are you? He said, on my mama's side, I'm 12 years old. But on my daddy's side, I'm Alfred Alamo Minga. I am the beginning and I am the ending. He said, on mama's side, he said, I get hungry. But on daddy's side, I am the bread of life. On mama's side, I get thirsty. But on daddy's side, I am the water of life. On mama's side, I get tired and weary. But on daddy's side, I told a dying world, come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Said, take my yoke and Jesus. He disappeared at the age of 12 for 18 long years. We heard nothing about him. I'm coming home here. But at the age of 30, stood up from somewhere, came to Jerusalem to visit the convocation, walk in the streets. He got an unction from God. In the seventh chapter of St. John, 37, 38, and 39, Jesus stood and cried and said, If any man thirst, let him come unto me and drink. Say, Believe on me, as the scripture have said, oh, out of your belly shall flow rivers of living water. But this spake ye of the Spirit, which they that believe it on him should receive. For the Holy Ghost hadn't been given, because Jesus hadn't been glorified. But he went on the cross, stepped out the back door of the body, kicked the bottom out the grave. Priest of the spirits, down in the underworld, stayed there for three days and nights. Looked at the grave on Sunday morning and told a dying world, I got all power. Yeah, 
yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me see. And I'm coming home. Then I'm in the upper room. He breathed on them and said, receive the Holy Ghost. But they didn't receive it right there. But he led them out to the foot of Mount Olive. He passed through Bethany. And he might have stopped by Lavis and Mary's house to say, this is my farewell message. But he stepped on an elevator that ushered him back to glory. And in going home, he waved at the rooster in the barnyard, the eagle on the mountain top, the cows in the meadow, and the sheep in the corn. He said, I'm going home. When I left home, I didn't have holes in my hand, but I'm going home. Jesus!